Hello, my name is Ronnie Cox and I'm the brand's heritage director for Berry Brothers and Rudd, the 300-year-old fine wine and spirits merchant based in the West End of London. I'm here to introduce the classic range of whiskies from Berry Brothers and to tell you the story, which was about three years ago, Dougie McIver, who is our master nose, and myself were asked to put together and develop a range of malt expressions to meet an increasing demand for such whiskies. Uh, we call this a classic range, a comprehensive and I would say must-have collection, epitomising four varieties, the uh, Isla and Speyside, the Sherry and Peated. And I suppose 10 years ago we would have called these vatted malts, um, today we have to call them blended malts, but our intention was the same, to take malt whisky from two or more distilleries and harmonise them to produce a result which is greater than the sum of its parts. These were put together from a collection of over 10,000 casks and we bottled it at a 44.2% alcohol, so slightly stronger than most of the other um, malts out on the market. Interestingly though, of course, the price is very reasonable. In this country, you would purchase any of these for around 32 to 35 pounds, whereas in Europe, they would probably go for in the region of 40, 45 euros. So very accessible in terms of price. Of these four styles, perhaps the most popular are the Smoky Isla and the sweet, fuller sherry cask varieties. But as the descendant of a Marisha illicit distiller, uh, I myself have a penchant and a leaning towards uh, the Speyside and indeed the peated cask matured. The Peter Cast Mature is basically Speyside and it's got the old sort of memories of uh, yesteryear when most of those distilleries would you have used peat um, in their malted barley processing. The one I've got in my glass at the moment is the Sherry Cask. Deliciously full, fruity and dry fruits, lots of those lovely spices you would expect from a Sherry Cask. Yum, and it's only Tuesday.